get to trivia this week. Uh, okay. Dan's finally going to participate, and I'm going to host. So here we go. So these are the categories. The first one's who's hungry. Me. So so we have yeah me too. Yeah. So we have uh, players first or last name involving food. I think we're alone now. Doesn't seem to be anyone around. Okay. Um, it's uh, team nicknames that end that do not end in S. Okay. So there we so go. Singular. Okay. Singular. You know. Uh, don't hate the play. So I'll give you a description of a certain play. You'll name the, the type of play. Second careers. It's athletes who became actors. Okay. And the last time we're dealing with player or team current drafts. So okay. we'll give our <laughs> guests. And our you can first. take two uh, of the same number. Yeah. Well, you can take two of the same number. Exactly. Two, two five point questions, two four, two threes, two twos, oh. and two ones. Yeah. Okay. And then we right. give Zach whatever's left over. Yeah, exactly. He, so he, I can't. I can't load up on fives. I, I'm right. Yes. Yeah, two, yeah you got two. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All but right. you can run a whole category. Okay. Okay. So the floor is yours. Uh, I'll go for second careers for five. Second careers for five. Okay. So we have. Let's see. The member of this fearsome force, foursome showed his softer side, selling flowers and working on the prairie. Merlin Olson. Correct. I'm screwed. <laughs> uh, all right. I got uh, second careers for one. I get my confidence up here. <laughs> second careers for one. If you smell what this former hurricane is cooking, you will scream Jumanji. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. There you go. Okay. I'm nervous. <laughs> Never been on this side. I, I, I prefer hosting. Exactly. Um, why don't we stick with second careers for four? Okay. This former boxer finished his career with a nine and three record and went to a successful acting career that luckily allowed him to use his first name in basically every role. <sighs> Wow. Wow. That's tough. That's a tough one. Mm. I know it's not because Tyson fought a lot more than nine and three. Um, yeah, I, I I don't know that one. Go again, steal it if you can. Yeah, I got nothing. Ayo, OA, Tony Danza. Tony oh. Danza. Do, I, do I lose four points on no. that? No, 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 no. Okay. okay. I'm going to do I Think We're Alone Now for four. Okay. Now, so. Tiffany. Tiffany. Yeah, exactly. Originally established as the Seattle Supersonics, this team relocated in 2008 under their new name. They first won, they won their first Western Conference championship in 2012, but have yet to win a championship since the move. Oklahoma City Thunder. Yep. Very good. Now, one thing you you had to look up when they won the West, didn't you? Who me? Yes, you. No, I, I have I have the question written here. No, but like, did you have to look up what year they went to the finals? No, that was one of the categories our research coordinator, our trivia coordinator, Amy did. Well, props to Amy for for doing that one. But I I knew that one, so shut up, Zach. <laughs> we'll do one later. Okay, Mike, you're up. Uh, we'll go for who's hungry for two. Who's hungry for two? Okay. Hopefully, it has nothing to do with Tony Danza. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Launching his NFL career as a first round pick by the Niners in the 85 draft, this receiver went on to play for 20 seasons and rack up multiple records in receptions, yards, and touchdowns. His 1,250 career points make him the highest scoring non kicker in NFL history. Hmm. It's not John Taylor, Jerry Rice. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm going to go who's hungry for five. Mm. Oh, okay. I'm Ooh. hungry. That's a Vartan question right there. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This spicy point god for the Golden State Warriors is credited for revolutionizing the game of basketball by inspiring teams to regularly utilize three-point shot. Not to mention he's a six-time NBA All-Star, a two-time NBA MVP and a three-time NBA champion, seven-time All-Star. 
Shut up, Zach. Oh, shut up, Zach. Yep. Um, Steph Curry. Very good. Did that be a new segment? Shut up, Zach. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Real, real life meets the show, definitely. <laughs> yeah, all right. Props to Abby. Thanks to Abby. Yeah, exactly. All right. Um, um, I think we're alone now for three. Okay. Leaving behind a legacy as a player fans love to hate, this center fielder spent 22 seasons with the Detroit Tigers and finished his career with the Philly Athletics. Though corny, he invited his male spectators to participate in taunts directed at opposing players, yet went on to receive the most votes of any player in the inaugural Baseball Hall of Fame ballot in 1936. Tyrus Raymond Cobb. That's right. And he played left field more than he played center, but yeah. Okay. All right, yeah. Sharp, sharp, and sharpened. That was, sharp I think you're alone now? What's that? That was, I think you're alone now? That yeah. Was, okay. Wait, no, that, oh, wait, sorry. That was new, who's hungry? That was my bad. Oh, okay, well. Yeah, that's fine, just I got, I got it, so. You got it right, so yeah. Okay, you got it. That was my bad, I apologize. You got it right, okay. So I was like, how does that work with team names? <laughs> yeah. Well, Cobb didn't end in that, so there we go. Not it, It's not that easy to host, no. It's not. It's don't, don't worry. No, I'll take I, I'll take the the three for a, a, a loan now. The next one, and if, okay. if so, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, 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 do that. Yeah, okay. Perfect. I'll Let's do go. um, I'll do. Don't hate the play for two. Don't hate the play for two. Okay. Tom Landry did a bang up job perfecting this formation with the Cowboys, in which the quarterback stands five to seven yards back off the line of scrimmage. The shotgun. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. All right. So, Mike, you're going to do. I think we're alone now for three. Okay. Wait, hold on a second. Do Everyone's staying away from the last time. Yeah, yeah but... I don't know why. Is... Yeah, I don't either. I was just thinking the same thing. Hold on, I'll mark this. Okay. Yep. There you go. Okay. Here we go. I think we're alone. Okay, after relocating in 1995, this team won the Pacific Division and went on to sweep the Florida Panthers in the 1996 Stanley Cup Finals, becoming the first NHL team to win the Stanley Cup in the season following their relocation. The former Quebec Nordiques, now known as the Colorado Avalanche. That's right. We were crook with a former, group, yes. former uh, Sabre and Islander. Yeah, okay. true. That, that please that big trade. I remember when that big the oh. Montaigne Turgeon deal happened. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I was in college. I was like, I couldn't believe. Like, I heard him. Like, I was in, in the student union. And I heard, like, no way they got right. Lafontaine. Oh yeah, yeah. One, it's rare the one a trade like that worked out for both teams. You know, yeah, it did. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's do the last time for two. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. For two. Okay. The last American man to win a Grand Slam tournament was at the U.S. Open in 2003. Tennis. Tennis. That was the last time an American man, male has won a Grand Slam? Yep. That would be um, Andy Roddick. Very good. Wow. No one's won since then? That's ridiculous. What are we doing? Nice. <laughs> it's, been, it's been Federer, Nadal, and Jokovic. No, exactly. Right. I mean, a commission. What's the U.S. What's the United States Tennis Association up to? They're developing, you know, well, have, tennis you know players. have Serena play against the men. She probably would have a chance. Oh, absolutely. Here. Yeah, absolutely. All right, all right, Mike. Uh, let's see here. I liked that one. So I did too. That was good. Uh, okay, I can't pick. I'll take last time for one. Okay. After finishing with a 2-14 and 14 record, this team not only ended the season without the number one overall pick in the 2021 draft, but now officially have the longest NFL playoff draft. The last time they made the playoffs was 10 years ago. Chino, I wonder what team that is. <laughs> <laughs> J-E-T-S, sucks, sucks, sucks. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I wonder who their first win was against. Oh, the Rams. Yes, buddy, the Rams. Uh, yeah, okay. knock him out of the block. That would be fantastic. Watch Trevor Lawrence is going to suck. You watch. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Last time for three. Last time for three. 
Oh, you and grandma were brutal that day. Yeah, I know. It was fantastic. <laughs> it's been 14 years since this California team last made the postseason, losing to the Spurs in six games in the first round of the 2006 playoffs. Mm. Sacramento Kings? Yeah. Very good. I like this category a lot. Yeah. yeah. It's hard. It's hard, but it's good. Yeah. Um, okay, I need to take one more four, so I'll take – who's hungry for four? Who's hungry for four? Okay, selected in the mm. first overall in the 1980 MLB draft. This four-time World Series champion won the Rookie of the Year in 1983 – and lead the NL in home runs in 1988. Perhaps his biggest accomplishment was appearing on, as, as himself on The Simpsons. Wow. Can you know, just repeat that one more time? And then sure. okay. Okay. <laughs> overall pick in 1980, MLB draft, right. four time World Series champion, win the rookie of the year in 1983, and lead the NL in home runs in 1988. Okay. Perhaps his biggest accomplishment was appearing as himself on The Simpsons. Um, Yankee great Daryl Strawberry. That's right. The four World Series is what threw me off at first. Yeah, I, mean, I, do, I yeah. remember, you know, like 86 with the Mets, and then the, he was with the Yankees for three of them, I believe. So, yeah. Yep, exactly. Daryl, okay. Let's do the last time for four. Last time for four. This. All right. It's a good one, too. Okay. okay, it took four pitchers to record this team's last no-hitter. Bob Malacky went the first six. Mike Flanagan and Mark Williamson bridged the gap to Greg Olson in 1991. The only pitcher I really recognize I, – I, the only pitcher I recognize in those names is Mike Flanagan. Okay. But he was all over the place. He was all over the place. So where the hell was he in 1991? Yeah. <laughs> well, um, you got to tell me that. I can't tell you that. No, no, no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with the Baltimore Orioles. Very good. Good guess. Yeah. Olson was the one that gave it to me with the Orioles. You remember? Yeah. Okay. I need one, 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 two, and one five. Let's go with. I think we're alone now for five. Oof. Oh. Mm. Mark. Okay. Uh, after playing their introductory game in 2000, this NHL team made their first Stanley Cup playoff appearance in 2003. Since then, they have struggled like crazy in the postseason, have only advanced to the second round twice since 20, 2003. Mm. Okay. And this is, a, this is a category where the – the team name does not end in S. Okay, of course. Of course, it's going to be something. Yeah, this will be completely embarrassing for me to miss it because it's a hockey team. Exactly. Uh, they made a cup final? No. No, no. not a cup final. They made a cup final. Oh, Second conference option. final. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Now yeah. there's a time limit I can't. Oh, God, this is tough. <laughs> I, this is killing me. It really is. It's appreciating. Yeah, I know. I'm glad. I, yeah. I, 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 I get it. Uh, uh, Ten seconds, and I'll give you an answer. Jesus. Mm. Oh, boy. Good question. It's a very good question. It's yeah. right. Uh, uh, is it the Minnesota Wild? Oh, very good, very that's good. At the buzzer. Awesome. At the buzzer. Yeah, we have to find time limit, which we probably should. Yes. Yeah, it's not quite as long as Vartan's, but it was. It was yeah, I was. I'm, I'm going like mm -hmm. I'm going through the divisions in my head. It's like okay, yeah. you know, like, but then of course I'm going through the, the realigned divisions for this year. It's like okay, that's right. So I had to right. go. Back, you know, like okay. yeah, All right. So I have a three and a one and a five. Let's go. Let's go don't hate the play for one. Okay. Your choice. Do or don't name this play in which a QB runs the ball and can choose to pitch it to another back. 
That would be the option. It would be very good. Okay. All right. Um, I need one more one. So it's either going to be, I think we're alone now, or who's hungry. And since I almost choked on the, I think we're alone now, I'll go with who's hungry for one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm, go I'm going to get something to eat after this. This and yeah. uh, the, Leafs, the Leafs drubbing of, uh, of the Oilers tonight again. All right. This soccer all-star played for the U.S. Women's National Team from 1987 to 2004 became a two-time FIFA World Cup champion and has two Olympic gold medals, medals to her name. Playing for the Washington Freedom, she serves as the face of Women's United Soccer Association from 2001 to 2003. Okay, Mrs. Nomar Garcia Para, also, also known as Mia Ham. <laughs> yeah, that's yep. great. Okay, good one. Uh, okay, um, so I have what? I have a, a three and a five, right? Yeah. Let's go second careers for three. Okay. Uh, this former Raider bought a rock, a crock, and a moth. Bought a rock, a crock, and a moth. Former Raider. Wow. Wow. I can't help you on this one. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm trying to think of a Raider who acted. The only one that... No, it can't be. Former Raider. Marcus Allen? Incorrect. Mm. The correct answer is Carl Weathers. Uh, Carl Weathers played for the Raiders? Yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah. Obviously, the rock, Rocky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. Crocodile and. Uh, Come on, Rock. Gilmore. And then. Right. Yeah, in the middle of the you know, grandma, you know. Oh, oh gee, that, was, that, was, that was nicely structured. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. okay. I need one more, and it's a two. And after that one, I'm not taking second careers. I'll go back to I think we're alone now for. Yeah, you know, right? <laughs> <laughs> that one was tough. <laughs> Okay, so second career. This is, uh, I think we're along now, right? Okay. Overcoming a championship drought dubbed the Curse of the Bambino. Oh, God. Lasting 86 years, this team has gone on to win nine World Series, most recently in 2018. Uh, I hate mentioning the name of this disgusting organization, the Boston Red Stockings or Sox. Yeah. Yes. It's so nice to have them like lose and be bad for a few years. So I know. Yeah. It's great. <laughs> this is the last question. What's the score? I've only, uh, I've only missed one. I I missed one. Missed, yeah. I missed a four. I missed a three. One sec. Uh, so you're leading by one. Or if you get this one, you win. Right. Come on, Dad. I believe in you. <laughs> <laughs> Give Come him on. the dark one. Give him the, you know, the screwball. You know. I got to take a five for the win, though. I wish I got the five out of the way. Yeah. Uh, okay. Fine. <laughs> I'm upset though. That we we're talking about the last time, and we haven't mentioned the Maple Leafs. Uh, yeah. it, it'll probably be that one. It, of course. All right. You know what? I'm going last time for five. Okay. All right. You have tw you have 22 right now. Okay. And what does Michael have? With that two points, he has 26. So I have to get this right to win. Okay. Yeah. Nervous. Right. Yeah. This one is this one's tough. I'll give you that. One. Okay. <laughs> okay, ready? Uh, this I'm still going to know the other one. What's that? I'm still going to know don't hate the play. Okay. Right. <laughs> this club was promoted to the newly created P Premier League in 1992. Three years later, they were league champions. So that's the key point, but I'll read the rest of it. In the 1998-99 season, the club was regulated. They were promoted back to the Premier League two years later before suffering regulation again in the 2011-2012 season. They have not returned to the Premier League since. Oh my God! I couldn't get this with fifteen guesses. Yeah, I would never get this. Jacob actually might get this, but I doubt he would. I just had to throw a soccer question in there. <laughs> I think I know it too. I'm just—I I have a piece between two teams. I'm just trying to think of which team it is. 
All right. It's between two teams. Okay. I think this is the more recent team that went down, and I don't think they've been back. Need an answer. Oh, wait, wait a second. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm going to go with. Give some time because you gave me time on that one. I, I'm going to go with it. I'm going to go with Aston Villa. That is incorrect. What was the other choice? Plymouth. Also wrong. The correct answer is the Blackburn Rovers. All right, I feel better then. Okay. So Holy my, shit! Why don't that we? Was my tongue. I was going to get. That was my next guess. Why yeah. don't we? Why don't we finish off the remaining questions? If it, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Go cube. Can you go to the don't hate the play for fives? I'm sure I'm going to know it. Yeah. Well. We'll give it to Zach, see if he gets it. Yeah, yeah, you... yeah. I'm sure he's I'm gonna know it though. Okay. <laughs> All right, Zach, you ready? <laughs> sure. Sure. And why? Okay. <laughs> this play could be huge. It features a quarterback lining up under center with a fullback about three yards directly behind him and a tailback a few yards directly behind the fullback. The main theory behind this offensive formation is to overpower the defenders by creating double teams along the line of scrimmage. No, oh, I think I know it. And I'm, I think I know it too, but I'll, know, I'll, 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 I'll let Zach guess first. I'm Do trying to one? think of Madden plays. <laughs> <laughs> Madden suggestions? <laughs> yeah, what's my coach suggestions on Madden? Um, The name of the – so you have a fullback and a halfback? Mm -hmm. Oh, just punt the question, buddy. You're not going to get it. <laughs> I'm not going to get it. Dan, you know it? I think it's the I formation. I formation, yes. The jumbo formation. Oh, Okay. I feel better now. I'm gonna both okay. All right, Zach. What do you want to do now? Uh, don't hate the play for four, I guess. Okay. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Neither one of you guys were fond of this category. Okay. Right. <laughs> this term is used to refer simultaneous violations by the offense and defense okay. that cancel each other out. Offset? Yeah. Yep. There yeah. you go. Yep. Still the dumbest rule in football. Yeah, yeah. it is weird. Yeah. Yeah, but, it, but also it, it also happens in basketball, if you can believe it. A friend of mine was, played college ball, and him and uh, another player collided, and they called a block and a charge. Right, which, make, which makes no sense. It's either yeah. one or the other. It's like it's like it's also it's like the uh, like in the NHL with the embellishment. The embellishment. I friggin' right. hate, I that. hate it's that. It's either yeah. one or the other. <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. Three. All right. Three points for Zach here. Okay, so. Don't hate the play. Ready? By signaling one of these, a returner can reel in a kick without the fear of being tackled. Fair catch. Yep. Very good. All right. Okay. Not through that category, so let's do second career for two points, bud, okay? I'm never going to get this, but okay. This one you might. You might. Okay. You might. You never know. Okay. This, this goggle-wearing center, NBA, portrayed a pilot, a substitute teacher, and himself quite a few times. Is it Kareem? Yeah, it is pretty, very good. He was on yeah. Full House. That's right. That's he was. <laughs> you carry Walton on the layer down the floor yeah, for 40 exactly. minutes. <laughs> and he was substitute teacher on Different Strokes a few times. Cut it out. Okay. All right, one point. One All right, point. I think we're alone now, but okay. Roger, this over. NBA, over, under, over. Uh, this NBA team got on a hot streak during the 1990s following the appointment of former head coach Pat Riley as team president. Riley constructed the trades of Alonzo Mourning and Tim Hardaway, which immediately propelled the team into playoff contention and led to four division titles prior to their departure. In the 90s? The 90s. Is this is this the one with... Uh, it's the one with, with uh, not an NS. Is it the Miami Heat? It yep. is the Miami Heat. Very good, yeah. buddy. Good questions this week. Yeah, yeah, great questions. That was fun. Yeah, this, it's, it's much harder doing it on this side. I'm all like, exactly. yeah, it's where am I here? Oh, hosting is much easier. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know, shout out to Amy for all those great questions. Great questions. So it, it is it's a lot of work to come up with all those questions. Yeah. Yeah, so sure. I'm uh, so I'm the champion of this week. I should yeah. next time you do it, or I can come on and defend my title. Right.